Girl, we got to talk about Amina and Peter Guns, okay? Now, let me tell you, I really don't know much about these two, but when I see on that gram, it is a hot mess, and we got to talk about it. Peter Guns done lost his rabbit mind. Yes, he did. When I tell you, so Amina, you know, I guess they're both reality stars on that love and hip-hop stuff. Um, she got a new boo. Yes, girl, she got an African man. Go ahead, boo. Yeah, honey. He's chocolate. He's handsome. He's fit. Okay. So they on the gram. Oh, first, before I get into the story, I just want to say thank y'all so much for liking and sharing. Make sure y'all like this video, share this video, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Gossip Girl XOXO. <laughs> You know you love me, and I love y'all too, okay? A big shout out to my homegirl, Gossip Game member, Toya. Toya, I thank you, and I see you. If you want a shout out, baby, ain't nothing but a thing for me. Just be one of the first to comment or always commenting, and I'm going to shout you out. So let's go back to Amina. Girl on a gram, Amina, she's working out, okay? Now they do this this little workout thingy thing where the man, he takes her by the waist. Mind you, she's upside down. Her legs is doing a split, okay? Like they're in some ballet or some shit, you know? It's just some stuff you see in ballet dances, right? So um, he picks her up with like cheerleading shit. But he picks her up, you know, he's doing, I guess, some weightlifting. She, he, he doing some workout, right? So... Her cat is pretty much in his face as he's lifting it up. You know how people mine is. They always in a damn gutter, you know? Uh, so Peter, which is her baby daddy, they got two kids together and, you know, ex. He gets on there. He going to hit Rich Dollars up, okay? He's another reality star. And he going to say, so um, does, does he lift his boyfriend up like that? Girl, no, he did not. No, he did not use that as an insult, okay? Calling that man, you know what, okay? Girl, talking about some shouldn't he be, doesn't he have a boyfriend that he lift like that, okay? Mm. So, Amina, she ain't like that shit. You know what I'm saying? She had to call Peter Guns. I don't know who called who, but girl, they was on the live, all right? And they was having a conversation. Amina broke it right on up. She said, you know, what's wrong with you? You know, mind you, she's not serious. She's over here laughing, you know, giggling and shit. I'm like, listen, if you want Peter to respect you, you need to put your foot down. You need to let them know how it is and what you're willing to accept. You know what I mean? Make them have respect for you because that's why he feel like he can say whatever he wants to to you and do and disrespect your boyfriends because you don't put the foot down. You need to be like Kiki Wyatt, okay? Now, y'all can say whatever y'all want to say about Miss Kiki Wyatt, but one thing, she puts her foots down. She going to let you know how you going to respect her, how you going to love her, how you going to honor her, you know? That's what I can say, you know, besides her voice, her personality, she not here for no bull crap, period. She got all them kids, she stay pregnant, and she stay having a damn man. How about that? Okay, but you know why? Because she does not tolerate bullcrap. She has standards. To be in Kiki Wyatt's life, you must love her, you must accept her kids, and she is going to talk to you, and she's not going to play no games. But all this kiki and you constantly laughing when you're trying to have a serious conversation, you're trying to make this man... He don't respect your ass. So anyway, she's on here laughing and talking about some, uh, you know, what's your problem? And he's like, you know, it's just weird. Like, why would you allow this man to pick you up like that? You know you got daughters. It's not a good look for the daughters. He, he said, I don't agree with it. I don't approve of it. As if she needs his approval for anything. Clearly, she's not, she doesn't have a good understanding with this man for him to continue to say, I don't agree and I don't approve. 
all this stuff that you do, and I don't know you, but girl, what I'm hearing, I hear he's a dog, and I think I believe it, okay? All the stuff that you be doing, did you get her approval? Did you think about her as your baby mama and say, well, you know what? She wouldn't approve of this. Nope. You're going to do what you want to do. So, no, 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 no. But you know what? She's allowed it. That's on her. So, she said, well, you know, just unfollow me. You don't have to see it. And he said, that's what I did. I unfollowed your butt. But she said, on another note, why do you have to be disrespectful? Why did you say that about, you know, my boyfriend? And he's playing dumb. He like, what I say? What's his name? What I say? Okay. Girl, it's so embarrassing. She didn't even want to repeat it, okay? But uh, she was like, you know what you said about him. She said, I felt it was uncalled for. So then he remembered. He said, oh, oh. He said, I'm sorry. I apologize. You know, that was very immature and very stupid of me to say something like that. I just still don't approve, right? And she just pretty much was laughing it off and saying, you know what? You know, you just... Just just don't follow me, you know? And girl, when I tell you the African man, he spoke out. Yes, he did. Mm, girls, y'all better look for Hey, you better get hmm. You better have your options open for an African man, honey. Okay? I'm saying. So, um, it is a totally different experience, I'm telling you. So, um, the African man, her boyfriend, I don't know his name, I'm sorry. Um, hope I ain't saying nothing offensive. Um, but he said, listen, he said, I'm African and I know how to treat a woman. Okay? Boom. All right? Because um, Peter, he, what I hear, like I said, I don't follow him. But girl, what I hear about Peter, he does not respect women. He play them. And I'm like... If, if if I'm hearing what I'm hearing is true about you playing women and you disrespecting women, when your girls get the, when your girls get as, you know, teenagers, that's not going to be a good example for their ass. Do you do everything that do you think of your daughters in mind? Is this going to be a good example for my daughters? Will my daughters learn for this? You know, nope. Nope, no bullshit. So... Hmm. I just had to let y'all know what was going on with Peter Guns and um, that Amanda. Oh, what's her name? Amina. Some shit. Yeah. And I want to know what y'all think about this. Why did Peter have to be so insecure to insult this man and uh, take it to his sexuality? For what? Mm, 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 mm. Talk about it. But uh, comment, let us know what you guys think. And I'll see you guys sooner than later. Bye.